Namaste. Uh, this, this talk is arranged uh, for the awareness of the common people uh, to tell you all that epilepsy is a treatable disease. Unlike the, the stigma that epilepsy cannot be treated or cannot be controlled and even it cannot be cured at all. Actually, it's not that so. There are multiple uh, new drugs available now to treat uh, epilepsy. And uh, moreover, the modern era has so many new technologies which can detect an epilepsy focus exactly where it is arising from. So unlike uh, years ago, now the treating epilepsy has become a very much, much easier job for the physicians. But it's a teamwork. It involves a neurologist. It involves an uh, epileptologist who deals only with epilepsy work. It also involves neuropsychiatrist, clinical psychologist, and last but not the least, neurosurgeon. Now, me as a neurosurgeon wanted to tell what exactly the role of uh, we have in treating epilepsies because I'm sure my uh, prior speakers, Dr. Prabhas, Dr. Arun has told about the you no know, medical aspect of it and as well as the investigations that are available nowadays. Now, uh, this, as I said that it's a teamwork, it needs to be first, the epilepsy needs to be diagnosed first and a neurologist and more an epileptologist, uh, you know, uh, he diagnosed the focus, where is the focus of the epilepsy. And not that all the epilepsies are, can be treated surgically, but a handful of them after doing, a, doing an extensive workup, it can be treated surgically. Now, uh, there are uh, different surgeries available that depends on the where it is, uh, where the problem is arising from. The one common surgery that we do is called uh, temporal lobectomy or more precisely medial temporal temporal lobectomy, what is called the amygdala hippocampectomy. Now, this, uh, the advantage of this surgery is that it controls the epilepsy so well that the need of uh, you know, multiple medications goes down. Sometimes we can reduce the medicine, uh, we can stop the medicine completely. Sometimes it can be reduced to a minimum one drug a day. So this is the advantage of that and if you work out the cost benefit, a person, uh, if you take his overall lifespan, the amount of you know, money uh, the patient's parents pay for their child is much, much more than one-time surgery. So this is a definite advantage and even the neurocognitive functions also improves after the surgery. So, uh, it is uh, definitely, definitely a, a much useful for those selected group of patients who are amenable for surgery. There are also other than this, there are some small lesions we find uh, which can be small focus of lesions which is uh, situated in such an area which are epilepto uh, epileptogenic. Those areas, if we remove that surgically, the patient is cured of uh, epilepsy. There are umpteen of things to talk about, but this is a brief talk. I just wanted to make you aware that epilepsy is a treatable and in sometimes it's a curable disease also. Thank you.